Hi, my name is Jacob, and today I wanted to talk to you about lights and lights for your office or lights to just make your room feel a little bit more comfortable. Um, I'm in my office for many hours in a day, and there are certain things that I do to make it a little bit more pleasant. Um, I have a really nice uh, sound system so I can play music. I add a bit of greenery. I have you know plants in my office. And one of the other things that I like to do is uh, just add some colored lights or some warm lights. And, you know, I'm not into the gaming RGB thing. I know that's uh, big. I need to press the fire. Yeah. <laughs> well, maybe sometimes I am. But um, today I just wanted to uh, talk about lights to make your office or studio a little bit more comfortable um, by adding uh, a pop of color or uh, just a little bit of warmth. So I have a few examples here uh, for you. Um, so three are uh, colored light systems and one's uh, just more of a regular light with an Edison bulb. You can see it uh, in the background just over my shoulder. It's already set up so I don't have it on the table here. The three examples I have here is uh, just a simple light by um, a company called uh, Aki. Um, they make a bunch of different uh, colored lights. Um, this one, um, you can set it to pretty much all the RGB colors, and um, it's a, a pretty simple one, fairly inexpensive that you can just buy on Amazon. And I've also picked up a couple um, lights by a company called Aperture. They make a lot of lights for um, for filming, and uh, this is a little uh, RGB light that they um, have. It's just a little mini light. Some people use it for, for video, and uh, creators use it, but you can also um, use it just uh, as a small little light in your office, you know, underneath your desk or behind your monitor. So I'm gonna talk about this as well. And then, then here's the third one, a company uh, by the name of uh, Lifex. They make all kinds of smart lights and colored lights, um, RGB strips, and um, that's what I have here is just an LED backlighting. It's like a TV backlight. Uh, it's actually just a um, RGB strip, and what you can do is you can just you know stick it behind your monitor or underneath your desk, have a little bit of uh, warmth. You can set it to like a nice orange color or whatever color you want. So we're going to talk about that as well. This company they have uh, you know a whole assortment of uh, these types of lights. They have bulbs. They have strips. Uh, it's similar to the Philips Hue uh, system. So um, yeah, so this is a good one as well. The first one I'm going to talk about is the MC. Um, this is a fantastic light because it does so much. If you're a creator and you're creating videos, um, this would be a good option as well because um, it could just be used as um, uh, an accessory light um, because uh, it has um, very accurate lighting. Uh, you can set it uh, to match the lighting, um, like your key light, or um, you could use it as a, a bit of a backlight. So it's very versatile. I'm just gonna get into the box and so you can take a look and see um, what this light's all about. So it's a tiny little light. And what makes this one so special is that it is Bluetooth. Uh, so uh, there's an app you can just download, you can connect it to the light, and you just, you know, it's easy to select your colors, any color you want. And actually the app has something that is quite neat as well. It has a, um, a color picker. You can take your phone and uh, um, select a color. The light here will match that uh, that color. So, so that's kind of neat. And it has some other uh, neat features. It has a magnet on the back. So uh, you can stick it uh, to any metal surface underneath your desk or you know if you have some metal behind your monitor you can uh, set it there or um, anywhere else that uh, has a metal panel um, it also has the uh, regular thread so you can put it on uh, any type of uh, tripod uh, to uh, to hold it and these also come with um, a velcro uh, double-sided tape so that helps you you know set it anywhere you want it is battery operated, so you can uh, charge it and it has a battery in it. But 
but you can also run it off of a cable. This is a, a USB-C. If you have even one of these little, little Apple um, power bricks or anything like a little five volt uh, um, adapter, you can uh, connect it to this light and then you have constant power. So that's neat. And then you can just leave it wherever you're, um, you set it and then use your telephone to, uh, to control the, the lighting, which is, uh, which is really, really cool. So let's just get into the box. So it comes with instructions, it comes with a little uh, carrying case, which is neat. And then like I mentioned, it uh, comes with a, a cable as well that uh, you can power the light with. And it also comes with a diffuser that you can just pop over the light to help diffuse the, the light. And so the other one I have is this LifeX strip light. So it's similar. It also has a, a phone app that you can install and control the light strip. So it comes with your instructions, which is uh, neat. And it comes with a little pad so you can clean the surface uh, when, you, when you attach the light strip. So here you go. As soon as you take it out, you'll realize that it's quite premium. Um, I've ordered a lot of uh, other light strips off of Amazon. And um, if you've ever ordered some of those cheaper ones, they come with a little controller and they, um, they're usually metal and they usually get kinked. Um, this is, you know, you can just tell that it's a very like, quality light strip, which is, uh, which is awesome. It's, uh, it has 3M tape on the back so you can stick it anywhere. Um, I'm probably gonna put this one underneath my desk um, behind me or uh, behind the monitor. This one, comes with uh, a little power adapter that actually plugs right in to a regular um, power outlet. And this is, um, this plugs into the power strip. And this is um, also how the um, light communicates with your, your phone and the app. Uh, so it, uh, it connects using this wireless device, which is, uh, Fantastic as well. So these two, the Aperture MC and this LifeX, they have um, apps. And then this third one I have here, the Aki Light. It's you know it's a little bit cheaper um, and it's a little bit more of a simple light, but uh, um, it doesn't have an app. Uh, so it's uh, touch activated. So you just touch it once and it'll turn on. And then uh, if you um, press and hold again, uh, it'll start the, uh, uh, the colored light uh, cycle. You can't uh, uh, quickly select uh, a color. What happens is it just cycles through the colors. And if you see a color that you like, then you tap and hold the bottom of the light once again, and that will hold that one color in place. So it's a little bit more finicky. It's not as easy to just select a color, but uh, it is a cheaper option. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up all these lights and turn them on so you can get an idea of uh, how they're gonna add a little bit of atmosphere to my room. So let's go. Well. There you go. I've set up and I've been using these lights for a couple of weeks now and hopefully they make the background a little bit more interesting. Uh, they probably add a little bit of uh, uh, depth to the room. I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull up my phone and uh, turn off these la lights so you can see the difference. There we go. So that's with the lights off. Uh, the one Edison light still on, but I'm going to turn them back on again so you can see. So. Hopefully that looks a little bit better having these lights in the background. I know I've talked about the LifeX and the Aperture lights a whole lot more than the other ones. Um, I feel that these are the better choice. They're higher quality. And um, if you're looking for colored lights, um, definitely the way to go. Um, plus both have the app. So controlling the lights uh, are super easy. And um, yeah, probably uh, the uh, best choice overall. The Aperture uh, lights are more versatile though and have a ton of options. And if you're doing content creation, it's probably the better choice. But if you just want a stationary light or a light strip that you can stick somewhere and kind of forget about it, um, probably the LifeX is, uh, is you know, a perfect light for you as well.
If you're on a budget and looking more for a desk lamp, I'd say the Aki light is probably the one for you. It can display warm light and colors, but just not in such a convenient way. The fourth option, which is just a regular light with an Edison bulb in it, um, you can see it over my shoulder. I think this is an awesome option if you just want a light that displays kind of like warm orangey light. And I'm not too sure if orangey is really a word, but it just, you know, it's cheap and I think it looks really good, um, especially with the uh, exposed filaments. So if that's kind of what you want, just a nice light that uh, doesn't display colors but is nice and warm, I would say uh, that's definitely a good option for you. So this definitely wasn't a review, but more of an introduction to some good light options if that's what you're looking for. I'll place links to all of these lights in the comments below if you're thinking about picking one of these options up. If you have any questions about these lights, hit me up in the comments and I'll try to get back to you. Also, if you like my content, definitely leave me with some thumbs up, hopefully a sub. Enjoy your day. I'll see you in the next one.